Hey y'all, it's Grace at Living Well Realty. I am back in the tribute today, checking up on this stunning house built by American Legend Homes. We are almost done, so this might be the last video. I am excited to show y'all, so let's go take a look. All right, so your landscaping has been finished. So you have this adorable tree out front. Your grass is green, which I don't know how because it's so hot here in Texas. But I'll just give you all a look at kind of the bushes. They have the bark dust done. Just so pretty. And they are pouring foundation on the house next door. So if you see that big pipe, that is what they are doing. Y'all, this is so stunning. It will just never cease to amaze me. The process of building a home from seeing y'all choose the floor plan, make all of the design selections. It has just been such a blessing to be a part of. And I love this house. Uh, all right, so this is your entryway. So beautiful. You have some great natural light in here and it looks back all the way to the end of the house. So you just have that length, makes it feel really open. So here is the room at the front of the house. So I have dirty shoes, so I won't walk on the carpet, but it looks great. You have some windows and a view of the lake. How could you not live that? Let's turn this light on, get a better look. So this is the full bathroom in the front of the house. So here's a look at this floor. Super pretty gray with a bit of like some colors in there. You have like a little bit of white. Almost looks like a concrete. And then I love that this tile on the wall goes all the way up to the ceiling, draws your eye all the way up. And then these really pretty, sorry, I'm in the mirror, really pretty faucets. Oh, I love that. And then here is the second bedroom towards the front of the house. So very similar. It looks just about moving ready. So that's really exciting. Carpet is done. The walls look clean. You will see a few other places where they need to touch up a little bit of paint. Maybe there's some dirty spots on it, but that'll be done soon. All right, then walking back here. So I'm gonna take you to the left first. So we have, this is the third bedroom up here. Also could be an office, but there is a little closet. So you'll see outside the window, they are doing that foundation. So hopefully they'll get moving on that house and you won't be next to construction for too long. I feel bad those guys out there working, it is so hot. Here is the laundry room. So you have plenty of storage in here, this hanging rod, really nice to have in the laundry room. And then the sink is almost done back here with a bit more storage all the way to the ceiling. So that's really nice. And then this is the powder bath. So they've installed the vanity, toilet and the mirror. There's a look at the light fixture. And then this is, I know you've seen it plenty of times, but normally kind of the mud bench area that they use as cabinets. So that is perfect. And then over here, this is going to be the media room. And so you'll see they got this installed. So the outlet up here and then the second um, plug. <laughs> Sorry, I lost my train of thought there. Um, and then this light fixture, I know that y'all are probably going to take it down once you move in, but that is installed. Then here's a look at your kitchen. You're fine. So they have installed the stove top, so that's exciting. So look at this. Oh my gosh, you can do some good cooking on this. 
So you have five burners. And then the vent hood, I know that was a big deal. Looks really pretty, just very simple. And then they have your microwave installed. We are just waiting for the oven, that'll be next. We also have the dishwasher. Oh, I love all of the colors in here. This countertop is so pretty. You just have a little bit of these gray veins. It ties in with all of the faucets that are kind of that color. Here's maybe a better look. Really pretty. And then the white subway tile is so classic. This can't go wrong. I think it's so timeless. Here's a look at the giant walk-in pantry. So tons of open shelving. Can really make it your own. And then they will finish up the fireplace. That should be soon. I love all of the windows over here. And then the next couple of things that so they're gonna do the beam in the living room, and then they're gonna stain at the open shelves over here. So hopefully that'll be done soon. We just have a couple more weeks on this house, which is crazy. And then for anyone watching, you may have heard before, but my clients are gonna be doing different flooring. So they went with just a standard tile and then they're gonna come back there and do their own just because they didn't love the design selections that they had. And you know, that's always an option, which I think is so smart that they decided to do that. It's very brave. And then they'll have a house that they truly love every little piece of. So this is the master bedroom. Don't worry, I took my shoes off. So you have this fan up here, great natural light. And then your fence has been done. The grass is in. The windows are a bit dirty. They'll come back and clean that. And then this house next door. So before they could get the fence up, they had to finish bricking. So I know the construction manager was really on them for getting that bricking done which has been done and that'll be painted, which is great. Let's go take a look at the master bathroom. So we have these French doors. This floor, oh, I love. It's just so pretty. And then it matches these dark gray countertops. My clients have a very modern taste and I just, I love it. Modern, but not too much, just very minimalistic. Okay, and this tub. Oh my goodness. Y'all, I just wanna come over all the time. Oh, this is so beautiful. So you have this makeup counter right here. They will lower down this light fixture up here, so that'll match the other two. And then we also requested that they remove those little glass shelves, so that'll be done soon too. So just a few last little things. There's someone here working now, so he's probably knocking out a couple of those items. Here's a look at your giant closet. So you have the seasonal shelf up here, and then two others. You have tons of hanging space. You also have some long hanging and tons of shelves. So that's great. Oh, y'all, this house is stunning. I am so excited for y'all to finally be able to move in and make it your own. I'm just sad that it's almost over. I'm gonna miss coming to this one. Oh. All right, y'all, I am back here enjoying your back patio. There's a nice breeze back here. I am so sad, it's really bittersweet that this house is almost done, but I'm so excited for y'all to be able to move in. And if you are watching this wanting to buy or build, I would love to help you. So click the link below, reach out to me. I truly love to serve my clients and would love to help you. So reach out to me and until then, y'all stay blessed.